Hey guys, this is Brendan's Movie Collector here, and now this is going to be um, a video that I really do not want to make this video, but I have no choice but to make this video anyway for you for tonight anyway. So I just don't care anymore because y'all gonna find out why I really have to do this video and. Even though I really do not want to make this video, but I have no choice but to make this video anyway because I really cannot straighten myself up enough to get over this and stuff like that. So, yeah. It's mainly, it's mostly this week for myself, probably. Starting in the beginning of, of this week, that is. Starting from last Sunday, I believe. From from last Sunday, yeah, that's right, and mostly this week as well too, for other reasons though that is. So, yeah, guys, I'm just not in the mood for this right now. I'm just not. I'm just not such in a good mood for this right now because there's just so much going on to myself that is, and I really cannot literally strain myself up over this. This is getting too much on me, and and this is this is this is getting ridiculous now, and I just literally cannot take this anymore, guys. I just I just really can't straighten myself up from this now, and y'all gonna find out why about in this video. So yeah, I really cannot stand up for myself anymore for anymore for you guys as of right now so y'all gonna find out why that I really gonna have to do this video because I am not such in a good mood for this right now and I was about to do some more YouTubing tonight and stuff like that but I really don't know because I'm just I'm just not in the mood for for some more YouTubing right now do some more videos and stuff like some more type of YouTube VHS videos and stuff like that for right now at the moment there so so I really gonna have to interrupt myself by doing this video because I I just I just literally cannot straighten myself up over this from the mostly this week that is for myself that is this this really is really stuck in this is getting really stuck in my head and it and it's really getting stuck in my brain and I just literally cannot escape my mind from this and I just I tried so hard and it I just can't stop thinking over this so that means I really cannot straighten myself up from this because y'all gonna find out why in this video that is that why I am I really cannot stand up for myself at all and Literally just cannot straighten myself up from this. From mostly this week for myself, that is. <sighs> so anyways, let's just not sit here and waste any more time. So let's just go ahead and get the show on the road. And let's get started with this video that I really do not want to make and stuff like that. But guys, I have no choice but to make this video anyway because I'm really stressing my I'm getting really too stressed out and too much anxiety going on to myself that is right for right now at the moment and mostly this week that is that I really just literally cannot straighten myself up from this due to my anxiety and my stress that's been going on that's been going on to myself this whole time, this whole week, probably, since last Sunday, I believe. Starting from last Sunday, that is. So, yeah. So, anyways, let's just go on and start this video. So, I'm really going to have to mention a bunch of reasons in this video why I've just been going through a lot of stress and a lot of anxiety going on to myself, that is. So, yeah. And I just cannot focus myself and I just literally just cannot, I can't loosen up myself over this too, so yeah. 
So anyways, let's just go ahead and let's get the show on the road. So let's go ahead and get started. So here we go now, guys. I really, even though I really do not want to do this video, but I just have no choice and I just can't stop thinking over this to myself. So, and literally just cannot straighten myself up from this. So, yeah. Excuse me. Sorry about the burp in there. So anyways, let's just go ahead and let's get started. So let's move on and let's get this video started. So let's get let's get on topic with this. On why I just cannot straighten myself up and can't and can't lose any and and can't stop having myself being in a lot of stress and in a lot of anxiety and stuff like that. So yeah. So anyways, let's just let's get started, guys. Let's just let's just go ahead and get started. So yeah. Anyways, starting in this video, right around I think this started back this I think this started back on Sunday, part of Sunday that is, in the right in the beginning of Sunday that is, which um I just literally cannot that's when I started having a lot of a lot of stress stressful moments and too much anxiety that's been going on to myself that is that I really just cannot stop having these moments that is to myself and this just won't this these these moments won't just won't go away like I mean is this literally just started back on Sunday. It literally is. It really just started back on Sunday. <sighs> yeah, you can tell I'm just not in a good mood for this right now at all, guys, because I'm just not in a good I'm just not in the mood for this in this video for right now. For tonight that is. So, yeah. Well, basically, it didn't basically start back on Sunday, but it's mainly just started Monday, that is. Guys, the first thing is that the reason why this this started back, mostly back on Monday, well, it, it, I started, it was starting to give me some stressful moments and, and, and some anxiety that's been going on to myself. Mainly from Sunday, but it all like it like it all started back on Monday to be exact. So I would say that. So yeah, that's the point where that's that gets me to the point where it. I just literally just lost myself there, and I just literally just cannot straighten myself up from this. So, anyways, the first thing was that. I tried to straighten myself up and 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 can't stop worrying about myself from a bunch of things that all started back from this week that is <sighs> guys I have bad news to tell you all this all literally started back on Monday mostly so that's the first thing that started back on Monday it's about my mom that is so yeah so guys I have to tell you all some sad news and well it's not a sad news but it's mainly just the bad news I meant to say there so yeah it's about my mom started back on Monday that is so and I'm kind of I'm kind of worried about her still because y'all gonna find out why about my mom that is and the about this all started back on Monday so yeah my mom has been getting sick and not feeling so well with and she's she's been she she started getting sick again well mainly she's not sick or anything but she's just starting to feel terrible from 
a terrible, awful migraine. That's why, that's the reason why my mom has not been feeling well this whole week, probably. Started back on Monday morning, that is. Yeah. This, this all started back on Monday, Monday morning, that is. When I just got a Ted's message on my, on my phone from my mom when I woke up. Excuse me once again. When I just woke up on Monday morning, from, when I got a text message from my mom when I after I just woke up on Monday morning and telling me that she is starting to have migraines all over again. Since the last one she had migraines was a few weeks ago. Sometime last month in July. Around the end of July, I should say. I can't remember to be exact, but it has to be a couple weeks ago. Yeah, I'm so worried about my mom because I really, I'm worried about that. She keeps getting these terrible, awful migraines sometimes for that work, that is. So, sometimes for that reason there, I, I just literally, that's part of the reason why I get stressed so much and so much anxiety that's been going on and stuff like that so yeah and she's been getting those my she's has been getting an, a migraine again since Monday morning for the past five days since Monday Monday morning to be exact that's when my mom just had a terrible migraine all over again for no reason at all and some of y'all might might know what migraines are they're like they're the worst part for people that get headaches and stuff like that that is the worst headache part that people can get that some people can get and cause them to be sick and and not feeling so good at all. Even though I don't get migraines myself a lot, I don't. Thank goodness for that. I don't thank goodness to myself that I, I don't get terrible headache migraines at all for myself. It's it's mostly just my mom that is apparently. So, yeah. Guys, guys, I really can't stand migraines that my mom keeps getting sometimes. I just literally cannot help it with that. And y'all gonna find out why about why I hate migraines so much, even though I don't get those, but I just don't like when my mom gets these terrible migraines sometimes, which that worries me so much. And cause her to not feel so well for the for a couple days or a week or something like that. It just depends. So, yeah. About why my mom just keeps getting these terrible, awful migraines sometimes for that reason alone there. So, yeah. I just... I can't... I just... I, it just worries me so much that... I'm just I just get worried about my mom sometimes like I'm I'm trying to take care of her as much as I can from prevent to to prevent her from getting these from from getting these terrible migraines and I'm trying to I'm trying to help her out by making her feel better and stuff like that like I've been doing a bunch of things for her like whatever she needs and stuff like that like um, doing <clears throat> like like giving her some some medicine and and some other things as well too like uh, whatever she needs for me to give her and stuff like that so yeah and she's been she's been getting 
a migraine again since Monday morning for the past few days, like five days ago. Since Monday morning, that is, after I just got a text notification message on my phone after I just woke up that morning. And I just went to my phone and I just saw a text message from my mom saying and telling me that she is not going to work and staying home because she's been vomiting, throwing up, and and she's been getting these terrible migraines again for no apparent reason at all. Which I have no idea why, what causes my mom to get these terrible migraines sometimes for that reason there. I just don't know sometimes what causes my mom to get these terrible migraines for a few days or one week or so. That's one of the, that's one reason why that I get stressed out and cause me causing me to get anxiety that's been going on to myself that's one of the reasons there because my mom just keeps getting these terrible migraines for no reason at all sometimes for that there so yeah and guys I am trying the best I can and I hope she'll feel better by tomorrow morning that is I just hope she feels better and And stuff like that. I just hope that. She, I hope she feels a lot. I hope she just feels a lot better from. The terrible migraine that she just got again. Since last. Since Monday morning that is. Yeah. I just hope that. She, my mom just feels better by tomorrow morning that is. So. So hopefully. Um. She'll feel better by tomorrow morning, hopefully. So, I just hope she's still not getting sick from those terrible migraines for another week or so. I just hope not. I just really hope not. So, I'm just saying just for the heck of, for just, just for the heck of it there. So, yeah, just in case though. So, even though she's still... She's still not feeling well at the moment there, but I'm st I just kind of get worried about her though, but from from her having these um terrible migraines, which those are the worst part ever. Yeah, I know. I just wish my mom just doesn't have these terrible migraines because they're the they're they're worse and and that can happen to some people though. So, yeah. Like some people can get migraines too, but they're the worst part for people that that get headaches and stuff like that and makes their head hurt and stuff like that and and such thing like that. So, yeah. Like yeah, I know. Even though I am been taking care of my mom and making her I'm trying to get her to feel better and stuff like that by um by giving her some headache medicine and some some type of medicine that is and and some some groceries and and all of the things that she really needs for me to give her and stuff like that whenever she needs needs some stuff and stuff like that so yeah. So that's one reason. That's one reason that why I just literally cannot s stop having these stressful moments, and I just I just get so anxious over it. That's just I just and, and that caused me to have so much anxiety going on to myself. That is so. Yeah. Excuse me. Sorry about the burping. So sorry I kept burping there because I don't know what's getting into my throat there. So excuse myself. So excuse, excuse myself from burping a couple times in this video because I just don't know what's getting into my throat that is. So, so bear with me on that, guys. And just ignore me burping if y'all can hear it or not. So, yeah. 
And another reason is that why I literally cannot straighten myself up and it caused me stress moments, stressful moments to myself and causing so much anxiety going on. And I really cannot straighten myself up and in my head that is and stuff like that because I and what's causing me stress so much and another reason is is back on Thursday afternoon around 4:30 p.m. when this happened to me it's it's not it's it's now for me this time guys back on Thursday afternoon around 4:30 p.m. I left I left work early around 4:30 p.m. around Thursday afternoon because I was not feeling myself good enough and I needed to go home. I needed to go get myself back home because I overwhelmed myself for no reason at all. I just wasn't doing so well with myself that is and why I have not I haven't been feeling good enough haven't been feeling so well enough that to um, work at my job and stuff like that around Thursday and stuff like that so yeah because the reasons why are is because back on Thursday afternoon I did go to my I did go to my to my work around 2 p.m. and I was supposed to um, work for five hours throughout 2 to 7 p.m. around Thursday afternoon at my job at my work. But guys, I had to I needed to get my I needed to go home around 4:30 p.m. That's that was around the time that um that was around the time that. I needed to go home because I was not feeling good enough to work throughout the rest of my shift around until 7 p.m. as usual from my 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 end work time and stuff like that as usual Monday through Friday that is every week that is so yeah because I was having so much stress going on and I was having some anxiety going on too much a lot of anxiety that's been going on to myself that I really just cannot stop having these and stuff like that. I can't stop having so much anxiety and I can't stop stressing myself out and cause me to get overwhelmed so much. Like I try to, I try to, I try not to overwhelm myself back on Thursday afternoon for personal business reasons though, which I am not going to mention why. Because that is private, inf pr private personal reasons, though, and I am not going to spoil that out about about what happened back at my job back on Thursday, which I am not going to I am not going to explain why, because that is against personal information. That's personal reasons, personal business reasons, though. So I'm only keeping that to myself and I, I just don't want people knowing this because that's that's personal business information. So yeah. So I'm all so that so what I'm gonna say is that I just kept getting myself overwhelmed that I can't stop making myself overwhelmed for no reason at all. Because I just literally cannot stop having having getting myself stressed so much and causes me anxiety a lot of anxiety that's been going on to myself lately this whole week since this week at last at least though so yeah so I so that's why I I was not doing so well at my job back on Thursday because I was not feel I was starting not to feel all that great and I was starting to not feel good and all that stuff like that because I just literally cannot stop getting myself overwhelmed 
I tried to like prevent myself from getting overwhelmed, but I just had no choice, and I it's it's just kept bothering me in my mind and stuff like that. Like my 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 head just just been bothering me from so much stress from this week as well, with so many things that's been going on, so many reasons and so many things that's been going on that I just can't stop thinking over it and and cannot straighten myself over it so that's why I needed to leave work I had to leave work early and just to go to go home for the rest of the, the rest of Thursday and stuff like that so yeah and also the next day after I after Thursday which is um yesterday which is uh still yesterday I believe which is back on Friday that is which is um after the after Thursday where I couldn't get I, I I got myself overwhelmed for no reason at all and and after I had to leave work early back on Thursday afternoon around 4 30 p.m. After 4.30 p.m. back on uh, Thursday afternoon. After I, I needed to leave work early to go home. Because I was not feeling myself good enough. And I just wasn't feeling all that great. So that's why I needed to leave work early. So And they sent me home. So yeah for the rest of Thursday that is. But, but on Friday that is. Which is after Thursday. Which... Friday comes and I called out of work and I needed to stay home back on Friday because I just still wasn't feeling good enough. So I have not been to work since part of Thursday after since part of Thursday that is, which I've only worked on third part of Thursday for like two to three and a half hours until four thirty PM where I needed to go home to get some rest and stuff like that and to relax myself that is so I j and because I just wasn't feeling good enough to work my whole shift back on Thursday afternoons around 2 to 7 p.m. for five hours back on Thursday afternoon that is at my job that is at my work that is so yeah since I just kept getting since I couldn't so I couldn't prevent myself from getting overwhelmed from myself that is so I just wasn't feeling good enough to th work throughout my whole shift my whole five hour shift back on Thursday back on last back on Thursday that is because around 4 30 p.m. I needed to get myself home because I just wasn't feeling good enough so yeah and and on Friday I needed to. I I stayed home back on Friday because I just what I still wasn't feeling good enough. So I just I needed to call. I needed I needed to call out of work and and needed to stay home for the whole day back on Friday because of that reason there. So because I just wasn't feeling good enough still back on Friday and I just wasn't I just wasn't feeling good at all from what happened to myself back on th Thursday afternoon that is at, at work at my work that is so yeah so this has been bothering me for the past couple of days and I just so that's why I couldn't straighten myself up from from those past couple of days since since Sunday afternoon I believe so yeah So guys, I have other things I'm, I'm going to be mentioning in this video as well too. So I might have to make a part two of this video. Because this video is like 30 minutes now. I'm almost getting close to 30 minutes. Hey guys, I have, an, I have another reason why that I couldn't stand myself anymore pretty much for right now at the moment there. Because... Um, Because I am sick and tired of those those sick idiots up on on YouTube that 
Um, that I'm not going to go into detail that much because I just I'm just not going to talk about that and stuff like that after I got brainwashed for no reason at all for the past couple of months and that causes me to get stressed and have so much anxiety as well due to that reason though so yeah because some of my haters won't just some of my haters won't just won't move on from me like they just won't learn and they just won't move on from me like some of my haters that is so yeah because some of y'all might know it who they are but yeah that's that's another reason why that i can't that i kept that causes me a lot of stress and a lot of anxiety that's been going on as well too and stuff like that so yeah because they just kept on troll some of my haters just keep on troll feeding me for no reason at all they just kept troll feeding me which i am i'm i am tired of these i'm tired of these people keep troll feeding me for no for and they just won't leave me alone like they just won't move on from me because i just i just couldn't take it anymore i just can't stand it for those for those those sick people anymore for those those type of people anymore like um like some some people on youtube that hate me and stuff like that Like I, like I said, I'm just not going to go into too much detail about that reason there because I'm just not going to go too much detail about that because I'm just not going to spoil it too much in this video because I just prefer not to. So, yeah. So that's all. So I'm on. So I'm just going to leave it as that, and that's just going to be as pure as simple. So, yeah. And guys, I need to do I need to do some different things on YouTube and all all the social media stuff as well too, which I'm going to go ahead and mention just for fun. So, yeah. I need to do I need to do some other things on social media as well too, like mostly YouTube and stuff like that because um sometimes that is whenever I get the chance and whenever I get around to it and stuff like that. So, yeah. And I want to meet some new YouTube subscribers as well too. I want I want to I want to um meet some new uh YouTube subscribers out there and stuff like that and stuff and such thing like that. So, yeah. So anyways, um so guys, I'm going to have to I'm going to have to stop for part 1 of this video because I just don't want to keep going on with uh in one video because this video is like 33 minutes right now at the moment that is so so i'm probably gonna have to split this in another part because we're gonna continue talking about what's been going on and stuff like that to my for myself that is so so guys i'm gonna go ahead and make a part two of this video so so i can continue on where we last left off because just in case my in case my phone gets low storage or something like that or if the video is getting too long and stuff like that so i'm gonna have to split it into, into two parts so yeah so anyways i'm gonna go ahead and stop here for this for this part and see you in part two